our Python on Hardware newsletter. So, this week on Python on Hardware, the beta... CircuitPython 6 RC, candidate zero, right? RC, RC zero is coming out, and we're about to do RC one soon. Um, lots yeah. of uh, improvements that are being made, bugs being squished. Um, if you have a bug, post up an issue in the GitHub repo because we're we're definitely looking to squish yeah. any remaining bugs. We, you know, whenever we introduce new features, new capabilities. You know, there's there's a stray null pointer here and there, but we're gonna we're gonna squish we, them. We need you to break things so we can get six point to be stable. Yeah. Um, in the newsletter, you should go to adafruitdaily.com in the newsletter this week. Um, the lady talked about the release candidate. There is a new microbit version 2 in Raspberry Pi compute module. That means Python. New hardware. On, new hardware. Uh, the microbit, and that means Blinka is going to be able to run on all the CircuitPython. Uh, sorry. the re- All the Blinka CircuitPython stuff is going to be able to run on the uh, Raspberry Pi modules. Um, last call for eight bucks shipping. Uh, why Python is a perfect language. Interesting article. And it goes over a lot of things that we've talked about. If you want to do machine learning, if you want to do vision stuff, if you want to do science, if you want to do medicine, if you want to do whatever you want to do, Python, batteries included language. Yeah. Um, this Friday, Scott has a deep dive. Um, we have some Adafruit updates, Hacktoberfest, um, the survey results. We're going to talk about that. Yeah, we opted into um, the Hacktober. We're one of the, you have to opt in now, and we're opted in. So if you want to join in, uh, go to CircuitPython. Yeah. Under Adafruit. Um, we have some more updates and guides. Uh, a lot of folks are playing Among Us, the game, and someone did a really neat uh, panels that go along with that. You can see that project. Um, you can use the uh, edgy bit with CircuitPython. Yay! Um, there's a lot of neat things that are going on with uh, like CircuitPython installing it on other boards. You can install it on the Seed Studio shell. Um, and last up, some MicroPython some release cycle graphics so you can see how yeah, you can see python 2.7 just like me you can see how python has evolved over, <laughs> time. over 10 years it's been going on for a while but now we're we're, we're yeah. done with that and we have some previews that we're going to get to at the end of ask an engineer with some of our show and tells we are up to 276 libraries that is a whole bunch and you can look at all the updates from the team, including yeah. Chipler's calculator. Projects, hardware, guys, tutorials. Everyone's yep. working on a little different part of the Circuit Python puzzle. Yep. And that team is effort. the newsletter for this week. Thanks, everybody. Okay.